What's good? Y'all know what the business is. One time for the one time. We grinding. Back is the boxing clinic in Morris. Your boy CJ Goodfiller. And I see, you know, Tyson Fury say, I pray for the whole situation between Dominic Brazil and Deontay Wilder and people playing off of that. Because Deontay Wilder told Dominic Brazil to bring your son on stage so he could look him in the face and see who's going to cripple his daddy. You know, the, the, I mean, I was talking about that yesterday. We went live a little bit last night. Shout out to the whole LDBC, all right? And, and these dudes, oh, this dude, uh, uh, Charlo hit a woman, and that's allegedly, but, you know, you know how it is. But he hit a woman, and, and this guy ain't a good guy. A lot of guys ain't a good guy. Y'all guys was lead to, uh, led to believe that Manny Pacquiao was this great person um, outside the ring. Shit person as well. Womanizer, drinker, all types of shit. You know, Muhammad Ali was smashing women left and right. You do, I mean, Sugar Ray Leonard, believed to be a, a clean-cut pretty boy, wasn't the, wasn't the truth, you know? Tiger Woods was trying to pose to be the cleanest cut, squeaky clean. He was, a, he was a scumball. He was a slime ball. So you don't know these dudes personally. You don't, you know? It's a savage sport. Somebody's suing you for, for millions of dollars, Dominic Brazil. And people just, oh, Deontay Wilder need to, man, Mike Tyson talk about killing people. Want to hurt people, put people on the stretcher. I ain't buying all that shit, man. You know, when Kovalev called Stevenson a monkey, you know, people downplay, oh, he's not a racist, and, and this and that, all that crazy shit Tyson Fury didn't say before. All them, all the crazy shit that he didn't say in his career, and off the chain, and off the wall type of stuff he didn't say it, all right? You know, all the crazy shit, all of a sudden he, oh, I just want to pray for the situation. Man, I don't care about that shit, man. I want him to go in there and hurt Brazil. And I want Brazil to go in there and try to cripple Wilder, too, if the fight eventually happens. Bad blood. And when they get done rumbling, hopefully it's a mutual respect for both both fighters after the fight. That's what the boxing about. That's what com com physical sport is about. Not about combat. I'm not, I don't, I don't care these dudes shaking hands and hugging and being friends and doing the Joshua shit. No, I want you to go in there and try to take his head off. You know what I'm saying? You know what you signed up for. You know, these dudes want these dudes to be lamb chop, play along, and buddy buddy, and cabbage patch sisters and brothers. And No, it's the hurt business. I want Wilder to say, I'm trying to hurt him. I'm trying to take his head. That's what you're supposed to say. That's the goal. The goal is to decapitate, destroy. You know what I'm saying? All this other off the wall stuff people have said, uh, Castle Mayorga called Timothy Bradley a nigga on stage a thousand times. You know what I'm saying? All this, all this other crazy stuff people have said. You know, but people up in our well, Deontay Wilder said he wanted to get a body in the ring or he wanted to crib Dominic Brazil and, and people making it, oh, 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 oh my God, I'm, I'm just flabbergasted that he said that. But when uh, Oscar De La Hoya around there dropping the N-word and calling Al Heyman the Black Hitler, ain't nobody saying nothing. Nobody saying nothing. Select Selective memory, you know, choosing, the, choosing who, who to ride and who not to ride on. But I'm going to tell you this, I support the champ. Take his head off. All that tough shit he was talking. And in that interview, I got a video coming about that, the whole little situation between Brazil and Wilder. If I, I'm going to end up dropping it sometime today. But um, in that interview, you could tell Dominic Brazil was lying. Well, I didn't say anything bad. I mean, you lying. Shut up. I want, I want Wilder to try to stretch that clown, man. And I want Brazil to try to stretch him. That's a good fight. No, we don't bring the kid, man. Forget all Tyson talking. I'm going to eat your kids. Billy Joe Signer hitting, hitting, hitting dudes in the nuts. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bring your bring your little butt on stage to see what I'm about to do with your daddy. I like that talk. Like I said, it's a it's a savage game. It's a savage savagery. It's savagery. It's a caveman sport. People want these dudes to be nice and oh my god, I can't believe Walter said that. All this other racist shit people be saying. All this other BS Tyson Fury and said over his career. I'm talking about what this man is saying. This other man around here kissing people. You know what I'm saying? Anthony Joshua around. You know, around other men with shirts off with baby oil on and stuff like that. Suspect as hell. You will never see no women on his arm and nothing like that. All right? Why don't you go point out, point out the obvious, Captain Obviouses? Stretch his ass, Wilder. And I want Brazil to try to stretch him. That's what boxing about. Everybody wants this to be, oh, it's a gentleman's sport. Man, fuck, fuck all that, man. It's, it's kill to be killed. It's hurt or be, or be hurt. It's the hurt business, man. Y'all know what the business is, man. It's LDBC all day. Your boy CJ Goodfellow, we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. All right, check out the Ron Uncut Podcast and S2010 College Sports Most Wanted for your college football, basketball, and a little bit of high school needs. All right, all those links in the description. One time for the one time. And all y'all people that was mad at that Crawford Danny Garcia video, I don't give a fuck. I'm going live and I'm going to address y'all individually in alphabetical order. We gone.